you guys today we are going to make meatloaf my husband will be a happy camper <laughs> so let's get this show on the road <laughs> Today we are going to make meatloaf. Here are the ingredients and the items you'll need. To make the tomato puree, put the tomatoes in a heated pan over medium-high heat. Dry roast until it bursts and skin turns black on all sides. Then transfer in a blender. Using a spatula, compress the tomatoes. Add the chopped onions, crushed garlic, chicken stock, but this is optional, a teaspoon of dried basil, and ground black pepper, garlic powder, and ground salt. Then press once again. Pulse until you achieve the pureed texture. Check for lumps and pulse again as needed. Set aside for later use. Preheat the oven to 350 degrees Fahrenheit. Put the ground beef in a mixing bowl. Add some chopped onions, tomato puree, Worcestershire sauce, dried oregano, thyme, some garlic powder, ground black pepper, ground salt, egg, oatmeal. Give it a good mix to combine. Grease the glassware or tin pan. Then put the meatloaf mixture. Bake for 1 hour and 10 minutes at 350 degrees Fahrenheit. Prepare the glaze by mixing the sugar, yellow mustard, and ketchup. Mix well to combine. And set aside for later. 30 minutes into baking, remove the meatloaf from the oven. Spread the glaze on top until the meatloaf is completely covered. Put it back in the oven and continue to bake for 40 minutes. Let it cool for 10 to 15 minutes on a wire rack. Then it's taste test time. Try this awesome meatloaf as I'm sure you and your family will enjoy it. Thank you for watching. Hi everyone. Today we are going to make <laughs> okay. Okay. What is this, me, love? Alright, thank you. Yeah. Did you do it like you normally do with hey. sir? Yeah. It's really good. Then again, it's always really good. <laughs>